The Sawmill Community Land Trust was born out of a grassroots community that had big polluting industries sitting right next door. And then at the same time, Old Town was being discovered and then home values were going up which was great from an economic development standpoint, but what it did was raise uh, land and property values and it forced many of the longtime residents out of the area. Then a 24 acre piece of old industrial property became available. So the community said, you know, it's time for us to take our future into our own hands and they birthed the land trust. The Land Trust makes housing affordable because it owns the land and it grants a 99-year renewable lease to the homeowner. They started these phased developments, so when done, we'll have homes for people who make 80% or below of the area median income. Well, that's 39% of the people who live in Albuquerque. I had lived in the apartments originally and after about a year and a half then, through the work of the Sawmill Community Land Trust, I bought a house. Sawmill and City have been partners for years. We fund a financial education process for prospective, new, and existing homeowners. We provided the homebuyer education class. And we're also working with a small number of people who might need some financial counseling um, so that they don't lose their homes. Um, they might be in the process of a possible foreclosure. So they'll come to us and say, hey, what do I need to do so that I can restructure my finances? Um, I don't want to lose my home. But our primary clientele is first-time home buyers. We try to offer different housing products for the different needs in the community. We have single-family detached, we have duplexes, fourplexes, townhomes, and we have a very innovative kind of live workspace where you can have your business at home. It's all kinds of artists. We've got jewelry makers here. We've got uh, leather workers. We've got um, the visual arts. Uh, you name it, they're here. The good part about all of this is that once that home is purchased, that affordability doesn't go away. So say when they buy here, they sign an agreement as part of their ground lease that says we will only take back a reasonable rate of return. So they know that they're going to get a good return, but it's not unlimited. So that that subsidy stays in place for the next home buyer and the next. As I tell a lot of people, when you buy a home in many, many places, you buy the home and that's it. But here, you've bought into a community. It's such a sense of community here that I have never seen anywhere else. And just owning a home, that's part of our culture here. Our history here is owning, and I have a home.